with the story you saw first on WPRI.com. A campus-wide alert is issued at Providence College after the attempted abductions of two female students. Now, the two separate incidents happened in the area of Admiral Street and Douglas Avenue as the students were walking near two popular clubs, Club Eagle, also known as Clubbies, and Louis Tapp, seen here on the Pinpoint News Tracker. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sutnick joins us live now with exclusive details on this developing story. Well, Karen, these alleged attempted abductions happening just several minutes apart. One happening right here in front of Clubby's behind me that you can see here in front of Clubby's. And tonight, the entire student body is being asked to use extreme caution. Providence College students on edge Wednesday after Eyewitness News has learned exclusively that two female students were victims of attempted abductions. Providence College sending out a crime alert to the entire student body. That's the absolute most terrifying thing I could possibly imagine walking home. Um, as somebody who does frequent these areas, sometimes it is a scary thought. Apparently, they, the victims um, were forced into a car and like their arms were trying to pull and they fought back and were able to get away, but all of us on campus are scared now. According to the Crime Alert, Providence College says in the early morning hours on Tuesday, a female student reported walking alone on Admiral Street after leaving clubbies. She says a light-skinned Hispanic male in a silver Saturn grabbed her by the arm and tried to lure her in the car. She was able to break away. Moments before, Providence College says another female student was walking alone on Douglas Ave when she says a white van pulled up next to her. Once again, this student reported a man tried to grab her arm and bring her into the van. She also broke free. It's very concerning, especially me. I think about my housemates as well. I mean, I'm afraid that they're going to be walking home at light. You always have to wonder. Now some students taking precautions. I really hope it makes people think twice about walking alone, even with a group of girls. And Providence College describing suspect number one as a light-skinned Hispanic male about six feet two inches tall. He's in his early 20s with a scruffy chin-strap beard, we're told. He was a passenger in a silver four-door Saturn. Suspect number two is described as a light-skinned male wearing a gray hooded sweatshirt and black pants. He was in the older model white van. Providence police tonight, we're told, are handling this investigation. And police say if this happens to you, if you are a student or anyone else in this this area immediately to call 911. Reporting live tonight with an exclusive from the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Catherine Slotnick, Eyewitness News. Developing